He's on six. Busby. And we all came from Manchester, so we all knew each other. We'd all been in bands that slogged around Mancunian pubs and hotels before we made it. And uh, one day, an amazing time in America, three consecutive weeks, Bands from Manchester had number one. It went Wayne Fontana, Freddie and the Dreamers, and Herman's Hermits. Three Mancunian bands who all shared the same office address, 14 Piccadilly, Manchester, all had, we had three consecutive number one records. It was like a Philadelphia moment for people from Manchester. And so I know Fred. I've known Fred since I was a little boy because when I was a little boy, he was our milkman. He used to deliver milkman, and my mum said, Hello, Freddie, we'll have two pints today, please. And he would deliver milk before it became daylight. A couple of my brothers and sisters look a little bit like Freddie and Garrett, but never mind. I went to um, Hullabaloo in New York, and on the show is Freddie Garrity with Freddie and the Dreamers. And those guys, Gary Smith and Dwight Hemian, they always taunted us British groups with things that we didn't do, like other people's songs. We, we used to do in our own songs, and Freddie and I got to sing Coop Super Califragilistic expialidocious. And of course, we didn't ever get any of the song really done because we were laughing so much at each other. Super califragilistic expialidocious. Uh, but then it was even funnier because Freddie said, I've got a new song and it's called Do the Freddy. I said, What are you talking about, Do the Freddy? How can you do the Freddy? What is it? And he says, Watch this. I said, Bloody hell, it's like Chubby Checker, only English. And he said, that's right, it's going to be number one. It's Do the Freddy by Freddy and the Dreamers. 